I, I read the script and I, I, everything that I that I had just said when I read it, I thought, my gosh, this is wonderful. Um, so it it wasn't difficult because that all seemed very very clear to me. Um, the only real preparation as far as uh, what we normally think of, of an actor preparing is I, I went to a dialect coach and, and uh, learned the difference between uh, an aristocratic German accent, uh, an aristocratic German accent as taught by a, an American or as taught by a Brit, um, a slovenly German accent, a, you know, all these different things. I worked with a guy out in L.A. named Robert Easton. He's quite wonderful. Um, and I, I tried to find someone to teach me how to uh, to Charleston, <laughs> and I did. I, fa- I found someone, and, and I didn't I didn't get it until opening night. And I tried, I tried so hard, but opening night something happened, <laughs> and all of a sudden my feet would do that funny thing. But uh, that was it. And coming here, I've worked with a gentleman, a, a, a singing coach, that taught me um, the most important thing I think, which was to to turn this into a, a, an exercise that would make make my voice stronger rather than than a a, a constant uh, thing that would make my voice weaker. Because people say, well, how do you sing eight eight shows a week like that? Well, the answer for me was David Soren Collier is his name, and he's he's terrific. He's he's uh, he's very un- unusual, and I tell you what, it works because. Uh, I get out there sometimes when I'm exhausted, and I think, you know, I can barely talk. How am I going to sing? And uh, I'll, I'll pull something out of the, the back of my head that he put in there, and it works. So uh, that was it for preparing. <laughs>